Okay, Virgo, what else can I pull out of your energy today? Take what you need, leave the rest if it does not resonate. All right. I have a $10 sale going on right now. $10, 15 minute freestyle reading. The information below in the comment section. Thank you all for your support. That's just for the earthly Virgo spooks. What do they need to know? Okay, wow, the King of Wands. Got some energy around sex today. Um, the King of Wands, the Nine of Pentacles. Ooh, we have the um, wish fulfillment, but this could also mean overindulging. Mm, so we're going to see. Okay, Let's see Virgos. I want to clarify the King of Wands for the Earth of Virgos today, please. March the 10th, 2022. Clarify the King of Wands. We have abundance and we have self-esteem for the King of Wands. I am a limitless being and I can manifest whatever I desire into physical reality. I got money in the bank. I got a damn good job. All I want me is a good ass woman or a good ass man. Self-esteem, I possess the gifts of the soul that benefit me and others. This person is very well off. Okay. They are open for love. They are open to love. Yeah, they're, they're, they're open to really, this person has a good self-esteem, probably has a type A personality, probably working a good job, uh, Have already have a foundation already built. All they need to make their life complete is a good man or a good woman, okay? All they need to make their life complete is you, Okay. Take that how it resonates. Because this person is already standing on their own two feet. Not saying that you aren't. This person can, can take care of themselves quite well on their own. They're already telling you up front, I, hey, I got some money. And I don't have any kind of issues with self-esteem. I know me. I know what I want. I know what I, I like. You know, this person is telling you they're, they're a damn good person. Okay. And they want happiness. They want to be happy. They're coming to the table ready. Okay. Ready to rock. Ready to roll. You got to understand this person is, is in it to win it. They're going to tell you, look, I, 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 I don't want no BS in my life. Okay. This is possibly you talking to them as well. I'm going to clarify the nine of pentacles. Clarifying the nine of pentacles for Virgo. And we have your health. Okay. I honor the physical vessel that enshrines, enshrines my soul. So you got some things going on. You're probably working on your health. Okay. You probably feel that you overindulged too much. I uh, may be eating too much or doing some drinking. You're working on countering the effects of that. Maybe trying to lose weight, eat healthier, drink more water, eat some, eat more fruits and vegetables. Uh, so that's going to actually help you shine. It's going to help you get that, get a healthy glow so that person can see you. Cause what are you doing? You're letting go of what no longer serves you Virgo. I am learning that endings are merely beginnings. So if you're single, that's going to change sometime soon. But while you're in the process of being single, work on you so you can meet this man or meet this good woman coming into your life. I'm going to clarify the nine of cups. There we go. Love, exciting and new. Come aboard. We're expecting you, the love bow. Soon we'll be making another run. <laughs> I commit to the practice of seeing the good in all things, ultimate love, beautiful love. Wow. It must be in the air. Must be in the air. Something good is going to happen in your love life today, Virgo. Open up. I'm telling you, this, this man or this woman is already coming into your life prepared. Be prepared. Remember that, that army commercial from back in the day? Be prepared. Yeah, be prepared, Virgo. Let's get another card for here. Let's see. Clarify the love card and the nine of cups. That's wish fulfillment. Okay. Empathy. I am open to seeing both sides of a situation. You're going to, this is going to be an equal give and take connection for the both of you all. Y'all going to feel each other off the bat. Like, oh, I can get with her or I can get with him. I can see that being my man. I can see that being my wife. Okay. <laughs> I literally heard the love boat when I pulled that card. So we have, yeah, the yang. Okay. This is going to be the end to your yang. Now, lick. Lick. Oh, my gosh. Lick. Anyway, look. 
<laughs> so the I did earlier, the first reading I did had the yang card, the yin card. So check that reading out. I'm going to put it, put the link here so you can watch it if you haven't. The first one, um, what did I call that one? Um, Virgo, they want a piece of your love. And that yin, the yin card came out. So this is the yang card. This could be your energy too, saying I'm ready for a relationship. I'm ready to put myself out there. So part one was they want to give you a piece of their love. And this is going to be part two. Not really wanting to, but you get to just yin to the yang. You want to find love. You know, this person already is saying, I'm putting it out there in the universe. Your yin is putting it out in the universe that they want to give you a piece of their love. And that's your yang or vice versa. I'm ready to receive, okay? Baby, I'm ready. Give you all of my love. Hold on. That's, okay, the first song was they want to give you a piece of their love. And now I'm hearing Levert. Baby, I'm ready to give you all of my love. So that song's going to be in the comment section. Wow. Okay. Okay. Whew. I'm so tired. And be poised. You're ready. Okay, you are ready for this. We have poise. Maybe some of y'all are wearing poise. Maybe if you're taking care of somebody or working in a home, then maybe they're wearing those poise. Okay. This is saying I'm poised for, for I'm poised in a direction that's leading me to somebody new, a new direction. I'm poised. And I can I can't, I can't do anything but go up and accept the fact that I deserve to be happy in my life. Okay. Big hips and all, big booty and all. Okay. Chaos and conflict. Y'all going through some things right now. Okay. Chaos and conflict. I want to clarify. And we have come to the edge. Yeah. Leave that shit alone. Okay. You are too blessed to be stressed. You are too too blessed to be going through, going through some conflict with anybody right now. Let it go. We have the blessed card here for you, Virgo. Focus. Okay, so we have come to the edge. You got some stuff that you're going through. If you're in a relationship or a relationship that no longer works for you, let it go. It's time to walk away from it, okay? And understand that, that this is a relationship for you that's going to take you to new levels of love, okay? And passion. Like I told you, this person is, is ready to give you all of their love. Now, they want to give you a piece of their love first reading I did. Now this person is saying, or you are saying, look, I'm ready to give you all of my love. Mm, mm, mm. So tired of playing games. So many men, I, men or I, women, I couldn't even name. That's the past. They're ready to co-create with you. Okay. They're ready to co-create with you, Virgo. Okay. Final message for the earthly Virgo. They're ready to give you a piece of their love. And this is saying, baby, I'm ready to give you all of my love. Just breathe. This is the third time I saw this card. I'm thinking about Shania Twain. <sighs> Just breathe. Just breathe. And get ready for the beautiful essence that's going to happen with you when it comes to love, Virgo. Just open yourself up and say, I'm finally happy. I'm finally at peace. I'm finally at ease with this new person in my life. Okay? Breathe. And we have chop wood. Get get busy. Work on whatever it is that you need to work on. If you need to change some things in your life, start that now. Start the pattern, a new pattern now. So by the time you meet this person, you can have you have you could have already or we have already found um, a way to uh, found habits. Found yourself in a new habit in your life, and we got a new life, a new life with the man you love or with the woman you love. Okay. I hope this message resonates with you, Virgos. Thank you so, so much for your continued support and I'll talk to you soon.